often uh, we say, and people say that often to you, you are the leaders of tomorrow. But I'm saying to you that you have already become leaders of today. I'm Secretary General, and I may be one of the leaders of today, but soon we will have to uh, hand over all these torches to you. You have to prepare yourself to be the leaders of today and tomorrow. Look at what had happened in Arab Spring. It was mainly young people and women who came to the street shouting and demanding their rightful opportunities and rightful uh, choices and places. I think it was quite the legitimate uh, aspiration. Some leaders have listened to your calls, but some leaders have not listened yet. Look at the case in Syria. Still, many people are being killed. More than 9,000 uh, people have been killed. Now, what my message to you is that be a global citizen. You may come from United States, Kenya, or Brazil, Sri Lanka, or any, any place ar around the world. But this world may be big, but this world has become very small. We are living in a very small world owing to the global communication. We are one family. There is no such a traditional national territorial border. There is no border lines. So look beyond your national borders. It's important that you have a global vision, you share a global ideals, and you are committed as a global citizen. That is the way you will be able to carry on the torches, addressing climate changes, food crisis, water scarcity, energy shortages, and gender empowerment, and global health issues. There are millions and millions of people are dying. These days, every 90 seconds, a woman dies from complications of pregnancy and childbirth. Every one minute, 60 seconds, a woman is infected with HIV AIDS. This is a totally unacceptable situation. If we are united, if we are committed, like yourselves, using all this global communication, global leadership, that we can eliminate this. United Nations has a great vision, but this great vision cannot be realized without your full participation. Let us work together to shape the future as we want, to realize the world we want. This is our uh, great uh, ideals and hope. That is why we are looking for sustainable development Rio Plus 20 Summit meeting in Rio de Janeiro in uh, June. This will be a once in a generation opportunities for us work together.